This is a piece of conglomerate, also known as nature's concrete. It's a bunch of cobbles like novoculite and jasper, chalcedony, cemented together by iron. It's naturally cemented together and it's called nature's concrete, conglomerate. And there's a lot of it around here in southwest Arkansas. What you're looking at here is a building that has been made of conglomerate. Instead of bricks or stone, the Masons used a whole bunch of pieces of conglomerate and built it together with mortar. Look at all the pieces of conglomerate in this. It's the only building, we're in Nashville, Arkansas right now. It's the only building in Nashville made of conglomerate. This was built in 1930, so it's a 90-year-old building, and it's holding up well. Uh, the Civil Works Administration built it. It was an American Legion building. Look, they even built this fireplace out of conglomerate. That is cool, is it not? Wow! And if you go to the Crater of Diamonds, you can collect pieces of conglomerate. They even, uh, the Masons built uh, buttresses. See how this conglomerate sticks out here for extra strength and support, I guess. But uh, they just mortared it together like native stone, and that's exactly what it is. See the buttress, it goes out both ways, both directions on this corner here. Uh, you can see it well in the sunlight. I want to go around the whole building and I'll talk about conglomerate a little bit and this is the front or the entrance here and we're if you go to Main Street in Nashville, Arkansas and you head south on Main as you get out of the downtown district there's a 90 degree sharp turn to your right and then before you make the next 90 degree sharp turn to your left to straighten back up and head south again, you'll see this building on your left. Like I say, it's been here since 1930, so a 90 year old building, and it's built solid with conglomerate. They also have kind of buttresses here that support the wall as well that come out on both sides of this front door. But, uh, Conglomerate can be found at the Crater at Diamond State Park. I've collected a lot of pieces there over the years. Oh, here is another fireplace made of conglomerate. And that, I'm sure, is was used to heat the building in the 1930s. Since then, they've added heat and air to this old American Legion building that was added to the National record of historical places in 1990. So, uh, it's a historic building. We'll go look at this again. The, uh, brick, I mean the chimney, not made out of brick, but made out of conglomerate. Uh, as I told you, conglomerate is nature's concrete, and what's interesting at the Crater of Diamonds, when you find it it really helped preserve uh, that, what is now the state park from eons of erosion. Um, lamperite is a soft volcanic material and will erode away, but shortly after the igneous intrusion in placed it there at what is now Crater Diamond State Park, a cap of conglomerate formed over the top of what is now the Crater of Diamonds search field and it uh, became like a concrete layer on top of the search field and protected it from erosion until about 10,000 years ago this uh, erosion resistant conglomerate began to break down into chunks like you see here into pieces and uh, then the search field eroded some. It used to be 150 feet higher. So it would be a, a, all gone if, uh, if the conglomerate hadn't preserved it, hadn't capped it. So uh, if you're at the crater, look, you can pick up a piece of conglomerate. There's a lot of it between Nashville and 
Murfreesboro and um, on on east of Murfreesboro as well. The conglomerate, the geologists call it Tokyo conglomerate. There's even a town between Nashville and Murfreesboro called Tokyo. Uh, T-O-K-I-O. -O, not T-O-K-Y-O -O, as in Japan. But uh, anyway, I just thought I'd show you this interesting conglomerate building and talk a little bit about nature's concrete. Uh, and it was cemented together with iron and this stuff is really solid building material. It's maybe not the prettiest, but it's very unique. The only one in Nashville, Arkansas built of conglomerate.